morning beautiful people how are you guys doing oh my god that sounds so weird because i'm so used to my old no he's not serious right now anyways like i was saying before i was really interrupted by my dog because he's always barking good morning guys how are you guys doing today if you guys hear music in the background it's my neighbor if you hear my dog barking he's in the backyard as you guys can see from that title, we are going to be preparing for my college graduation. Really cannot believe I'm saying those words. Like, I'm preparing for my college graduation. That is crazy, y'all. It's been a long four years being at St. John's University. It's definitely been an emotional roller coaster. I don't know what it is, but being that things are coming to an end, I guess everything is just piling on and hitting me all at once. You know, I'm about to hit adulthood. Like, this is really the end of an era, but the beginning of a new one type of vibe. And I don't know, I've just been so emotional. I don't even know how to explain how I've been feeling. Um, but all I can say is I'm glad to take you guys along with me because I know on my channel I've never really done any college content as I probably should have. But all I want to say is that I want to share this moment with you guys because it's very important to me as much as I think it should be important to you and anybody who is watching this. First of all, congratulations to all the graduates out there, people who are graduating from middle school, high school, college, whatever it is, congratulations, you made it, and now you're going to begin your next step. It is literally Wednesday, May 18th. My graduation is May 22nd, so we are starting a preparation video today, being that I have a couple of things planned of course to get ready you know my hair and nails my eyebrows shaving all that good stuff but today in particular we really are not going to be doing too much give you guys a little rundown of what we're going to be doing um just in general i'm going to be getting my nails done of course my hair i'm not getting done i'm going to be doing my natural hair myself um and the only reason why i decided to just do my natural hair is because i have trips planned already for this year and really not trying to put as much heat in my hair um being that i already put heat in my hair like three times already this year because i had so much important events that happened these past couple of weeks so i'm trying to just take it slow all right nails i'm getting it done on saturday my toes are getting done on saturday my eyebrows are getting done on friday i have a facial appointment tomorrow and today we're only doing the basics first thing first i ordered two dresses from fashion nova and both of them came yesterday thank the lord they came in time one of them i rushed because i originally wanted well i'm gonna tell you guys let me just get the packages first so we have two packages here from fashion nova one of them is white and one of them is like cream this one is the one and only shoulder pad mini dress it's the cream one so this is the dress it's cream it kind of looks like it's a little bit see-through but it's not but I, I don't really like this dress this was the second dress that I ordered. No, this was the first dress that I ordered. And honestly, the only reason why I ordered it because the dress that I originally wanted got sold out so quickly and I was so obsessed. I was just like, oh my God, I'm gonna have to settle. I'm gonna just get this. But I'm so glad that that other dress came back in stock because this is not really it, but that's one. This is definitely much better. This is giving graduation. It just looks a little big, y'all. But we're gonna try it on and we're gonna see. This is dress number one. All right, don't mind my armpits, they're not shaved. The back is open because I didn't zip it. But this is basically how the back looks. It gives like a little booty shape. Um, definitely, definitely emphasizes my booty. And I like that, but this is not giving graduation. Like this is really giving party, vacation vibe classy and stuff like that which is another reason why i chose this because i like dresses that have a pad right here i think it really gives off elegant and classy which is what i was going for but this is definitely not a graduation dress so let's try on dress number two this is the other dress and i absolutely hate it like this is a dress i wanted it looks so much better on the model but on a me it's it's not giving y'all it's really not given like I just feel like it's way too long like I hate long dresses I don't know if it's because my hair is not done and I don't have on no heel I'm about to not go to graduation because this looks terrible like it fits but it's a little looser hair which that's what it was giving on the like the person that was modeling it but it's not it's not working for me three days until graduation we're not gonna find a new dress though. I'm sorry we missed your call. St. John's University students are on 
I just spent an hour and a half trying to find a new graduation dress. A new graduation dress. T minus three days. And I have no dress. I have no shoes. Going on. What is God telling me? The other day I thought I was going to have good luck. You guys just witnessed because I didn't get my hood for graduation. A lot of people didn't get their hood for graduation. What is St. John's University doing? Why are you sending me half of my graduation attire and not the full thing? Please, somebody send help. Now, the only thing that I'm missing right now is to print my grad pass. I'm not really too sure how to print my grad pass. Oh, right here. Print grad. grad. But that's it for now. If I find the hot glue gun later, then I'll talk to you guys later. Other than that, see you guys tomorrow. And we're going to be on our way to graduation. I can't even imagine how I look on this camera right now. It is day two for preparation for graduation. And if you ask me, I'm not excited. <laughs> like, I don't even know what it is, but I'm not excited. It's currently 9-28, May 19th. So I basically have T minus two days until graduation. Today I have a facial appointment. My facial appointment is at 1.15. I'm not really getting anything too special or crazy. I'm just going to get derma planning for now because that's the only thing I could think about getting. And I feel like my skin just needs a manual exfoliation because I don't know what's going on lately. But one second my skin is clearing and the next second it's just acting up. Good morning everybody it's t-minus one day until my graduation and honestly i don't know how to feel i don't know if i'm getting more excited as the day gets closer i just want to do my eyebrows this is how it's looking i have to shave and stuff like that which i feel like i'm gonna do today so that way tomorrow i just need to do my hair and nails and then today i'm also gonna glue my um headband on my cap if I could find a hot glue gun, hopefully, but... Alright guys, so we was against the Juicy Pride, I'm home. We're gonna be shaving my legs and my under armpit and my belly and my chest hair. Make fun of me because I have chest hair, right? Make fun of your sister. So I typically like to go in with this whipped scrub. I like it a little bit only because I feel like it's very calm, not, doesn't have too much fragrance. You know, it's very smooth. I'm trying to find the right scrub that I like. I haven't really yet found a good scrub for me, but let's go in with this in there. Sensitive Formula Coconut Oil Hair Remover. I feel like this one is so much better than the regular nair. I am putting on the nair on my legs. Y'all, look at how hairy my legs are. So basically, I like to do it just like this. Guess what? I forgot to exfoliate before I do this. But I'm going to exfoliate after, so that's all right. But typically, I would exfoliate, then do this, then exfoliate. But since I did this first, I'm going to exfoliate after really well. So that way, nothing bad will really happen. With my legs, I don't really stress it too much because I don't really get, like, ingrowns or anything on my legs. And I don't really have strawberry legs like that because I exfoliate majority of the time, so I'm pretty good. So 